up everybody, it's Pyro here, uh, back with another video that is surprisingly not Minecraft, um, or other video games for that matter. Today I'm going to be showing just a small trick on Edpuzzle, if you use that for school. Um, I know it can be frustrating because you can't skip ahead, it'll just say locked. I mean, I've already watched, I've already wa uh, done the trick for this video, so it's not going to show up uh, for me, but essentially... You've got uh, an assignment here, and you've got to watch this video, but let's say you already know what's in the video, or you just don't want to watch the video, or there's this where you have this question, you've already answered it, and there's all this other space here, and you have to finish the video. If you don't want to deal with all that, or there's any other reason why you want to skip a video, I have a solution for you. So, um, the first step, do this. It allows you to skip to any part of the video, even if it's locked first step to it is you need to uh, right click this inspect element go over to here and delete it delete element um, and then close that out you don't need it anymore and then what you need to do is you need to right click the video don't click any of these you need to right click it again and you should see an option called show controls you want to click that it should be the second one and then you'll see this white bar appear at the bottom now if you Okay, well, I guess I was a little bit wrong. If you click anywhere in the middle of this, it's just going to send you back and tell you locked. However, if you were to click the very end, um, it'll you should have the questions appear like this. Um, it'll go in order, and you just got to click continue and get through all of these um, questions or notes or whatever and then you should be done. Uh, but that's essentially the whole trick. So uh, yeah, I hope you enjoyed, and if you'd like to see more little tricks like this, whenever I find them, I'll post them. Anyway, see you next time.